It's Saturday morning and we're on the rim trail. We woke up, mom woke up. And checked it out. And said, hey, Tony, let's wake up. It looks pretty nice out. It's only 5.20, but I think we should get out. So we did. We walked about five minutes to get to the edge of the canyon and the rim trail. And now we've been walking along, checking out the views, watching the sunrise. And had breakfast with an elk who was close enough to, we could have reached out and touched his antler. Yeah, he was, we definitely could have. And we've had the place to ourselves. There was a Sunrise bus shuttle service that came by, empty, no one on it, no one got off, no one got on. The sun is really making an appearance now. For being Yesterday the, it, oh go ahead. For being the most, one of the most popular tourist attractions in the whole continent, we are catching it early enough in the season where, you know, there's never more than a handful of people that you can see right now at this time of day especially. Especially where we've been and yesterday we hiked pretty far down. In the afternoon when we came back to that main lodge for oh. a minute, it was packed. The, there were four of those enormous motor coach buses right outside the door. Each one pouring out people, foreigners I might add. Mostly they were, uh, they seemed mostly oriental and they're just got to be disappointed because at that point it was foggy, cloudy. Raining. That was before the snow but it was slushy. It was it, it was, was raining, rainy, pretty steady, and we didn't, didn't care because we had been up since five, and we had been out hiking nine hours, and we were just coming in to sit down and get our reservation. But um, that's when we saw that touristy type uh, atmosphere. All they could do was go in and buy some food or a gift shop. Here we are out again, just next, almost all alone. <laughs> 